Hey everyone, welcome back to the channel. Have you ever came across a website in another language and had to copy and paste text into a translator just to understand it? Well, you don't have to do that anymore. Your iPhone has a built-in tool that lets you translate an entire web page in Safari in just a few taps. In today's video, I'll show you exactly how to use Safari's translation feature and what to do if you don't see the option on your iPhone. Let's get started. Now this works on any iPhone running iOS 18 and supports multiple languages. Here's how to do it. Open up Safari and then go to the web page you want to translate. Now tap on the pages icon or the double A depending on what iOS version you're running. It's at the bottom to the left of your address bar. In the pop-up menu, select translate and the entire website will instantly switch to your preferred language. If you want to go back to the original language, just tap on the menu again and select View Original. And it goes back almost instantly. That's it. Safari will automatically detect the language and translate it into one of your preferred languages. If the translate option isn't showing up for you, don't worry, it's an easy fix. Open up settings on your iPhone, then navigate to General, then go to Language and Region. And here, add your preferred language under the preferred language section. Now, when you visit a website in a supported language, Safari will automatically offer translation as an option. This is a game changer for anyone who reads international news, shops on a website that isn't in your native language, travels frequently, and needs to translate important info on the go. This is a great option instead of having to use third-party apps or maybe copying and pasting into Google Translate, Safari lets you do it all without leaving the browser. So now that you know how to instantly translate any website on your iPhone, give it a try and let me know if it helped. If you found this tip helpful, please hit that like button, subscribe for more iPhone tips, and turn on notifications so you never miss a new video. Thank you so much for watching and I'll see you in the next one.